Okay, so a lot of people have questions about the procedure I got and my new teeth. So I'm gonna answer them in this video. So I've always had a gap my entire life, but I am a victim of domestic violence. So this tooth right here got knocked out in one of the situations and I got a temporary flipper. That's when you have to take it in and out when you're eating or brushing your teeth. You're not really supposed to sleep with it. Um, at that time, back in 2016, that cost me $700. And it was supposed to last, I think, like six months, not long. So that's what it looked like. Um, it matched my natural smile perfectly. You know, most people couldn't tell unless I told them. But I'm going to show you guys it. This is what it looked like. So this entire thing was in my mouth constantly. It was super uncomfortable, um, made the like roof of my mouth irritated all the time. So I hated wearing it, especially whenever I went out to eat. But, you know, I dealt with it. And instead of it lasting six months, I had that thing since 2016. So I had it for six years. Um, I went to a lot of dentists. Most of them gave me about the same pricing. It was going to be $10,000 because I had gum damage. Um, there was bone that needed to be replaced there and the implant itself plus all the other dental work. So, ain't nobody had no $10,000 in 2016. I didn't. So I just dealt with the little flipper. This year, I told myself, like, no matter what, I'm going to get this fixed myself because, you know, I have been getting a run around, like, oh, I'm going to pay for it, this, that, and the third. So I, I was like, you know what, if you want something done, do it yourself. So I did it. So a friend of mine recommended me to Dr. Trev Thomas. Um, he is the dentist who did Krishan's tooth. He's done a lot of other, like, really, really good work. Also, since I had that flipper for six years and I wasn't taking it out as much as I should have, especially when I was eating and whatnot, I got a cavity on the other tooth that I did have, so I had to get that repaired as well. So my first appointment, they drilled down my teeth and inserted the implant. They also did a whitening treatment and took molds for my veneers. Um, but they didn't make me leave like that. I had to wait a week before I could come back. Um, during that week, they told me to stay away from like hard foods and sticky foods while I had the temporary caps on my teeth. So after a week, I went back and that was the day that I got these put on. Um, and I'll show you guys the videos of that. So here he is putting on that bridge and my veneer. I beat you. I forgot to mention that implants take four months to heal. So while that's healing, I still have like a fake tooth on it. And then in four months, I go back. Let me know if you want a part two.